You're gonna be looking to find the target and find a home for those heavy hands. This is just not a guy anybody wants to get in a slugfest with. More often than not, you end up twitching on the canvas, concussed. You're playing with fire here if you choose to stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with this guy. This guy has world-class throws. Look for his opponent to try to keep as far away from this man's clinch as possible. Because if he gets a hold of you, the results are devastating. Yes, here he is, the founder of Jeet Kune Do, and as Dana White calls him, the father of modern mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee making the walk tonight. You can make the argument no man has had as much of an influence on UFC fighters as Bruce Lee has. Quoted as saying, the best fighter is someone who can adapt to any style. Man, it would have been great to see what Bruce Lee could have done inside the UFC. He is making the walk tonight. This guy has some of the best throws I have ever seen in all my years of commentating. His timing, his delivery, and the power in which he delivers these techniques is beautiful to watch. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. So these fighters are just a year apart with some differences in height and a similar reach. We go inside the octagon. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, a referee in charge of the octagon, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment U.S. fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 15 wins, four losses. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, Paul. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon! You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. This has been one of the most highly anticipated matchups for a long time. And ladies and gentlemen, strap yourselves in because it's about to go down right now. We are underway. Straight right. He missed. to his highlight reel. Lands a giant kick. That he landed a huge uppercut. Back uppercut. and forth we go. Nasty combinations here. Really threw everything into that uppercut, but fell short. Unable to connect with the right hand there. Nice punch by Lee. Swing and a miss with that straight left hand. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Oh, that head kick landed. Almost in range with the straight left, but that's a miss. Excellent head movement. This is a huge hook to the head. Oh, 
just unable to quite find that range. And he connects with the punch there. Well, the kick lands to the head there, Joe, but I gotta say, he moved right into it. So let's see if he can make the adjustments, try to circle out, and at the very least, get that guard up. Not a good look for him here. Nice spinning back fist right there. Beautiful combination there. Felder gets caught by the inside leg kick. A few more, and that'll leave a mark. Trying to find a home for that right hand. We march on three minutes to go. He's circling to his right Both here. Fighters exchange in the pocket here. Just missed with the huge kick. Using his jab effectively here, it's an underutilized weapon by a lot of fighters, not this guy. Going to the kick here, Joe. Well, he's always working off of that jab. Nice jab there by Lee. There's a left hand. Front kick to the face. Inside leg kick. And there's a nice jab. Felder's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Well, some have gotten through, Joe. This shot is blocked. Under two minutes to go. Able to land the left hand there. Oh, and he continues to snap off these jabs. Good way to keep his opponent at distance. Flying knee attempt. Head kick. Big roundhouse now just misses. He got tagged there. Beautifully timed and place kick there by the Irish Dragon, Paul Felder. Felder with a knee to the body. Irish Dragon gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up, Joe. One minute to go in the round. Very rare technique. You don't see too many guys throwing that sidekick. Counter left attempt is no good, Joe. Well, that kick landed the body beautifully placed right underneath that elbow. Let's see if he makes the adjustments now defensively to avoid opening up that midsection to further damage by that kick. Splits the guard and connects with the punch. Misses with the left hook. Check that one. And just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. Slips the punch nicely oh. there. Works oh. out for the end of round one. Beautiful work. Beautiful work. That right straight left hook combination is working great. Now let's get back out there and really start to set up those combinations. And here we go. Let's take a look at some of this action here. And there's a nice head kick that lands. And here's another head kick. And here's one more perfectly placed head kick. You can really see how awesome that round was by these highlights. Brittany Palmer is here as well. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, here we go with round two. All right, so second round getting underway now. Not a bad first round. Both fighters had their moments. Looked like at times they were just getting warmed up a little bit, perhaps a little bit of a feeling out process over that first minute. What's your thoughts on what we saw there in that first round? Irish Dragon gets touched by that kick there. Switching stances here. Throwing that jab, no good. Felder's lower jaw is just nasty at this point. Really swollen in that area now. 
Oh, big right hook, but a whiff. Fainting with that kick. Well, he's looking for that left hand, just out of range, though, with it. We show you the total strikes. Oh, that's a big block, Joe. Nice kick there by Felder. Also, he gets clipped once again here, Joe, and he continues to be vulnerable by leaning in. He's keeping his head on the center line. He's got to change things up a little bit here. Huge kick misses. Now he counters with a right hook to the head. Head kick. Oh, beautifully done with the hook there by Lee. Nice leg kick. Oh, and he caught the kick. Axe kick. Checks the leg kick. Felder gets caught by the straight punch. They are trading huge punches here. That's a nice clean shot. Well, without much resistance, he continues to find a home for that jab, much like he did in the previous round. Nice combination. Well, looks as though his leg is hurt here. You can even see him limping a little bit. Nice inside leg kick, not even telegraphed. Well, he has landed some good shots tonight, Joe, but as yet, he has been unable to string together any solid combinations, and that has served to keep his opponent in this fight. So let's see if he can change up the tempo a little bit with his strikes and try to put together a combination that is more damaging to his opponent. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two, much more aggressive now here and starting to find himself in the pocket. Able to land with the left hand. Oh, beautiful, beautiful kick to the butt. Just over two minutes to go. Oh! Well, Joe, I know he respects the power coming back, but it looked like he moved right into that kick to the body, and his opponent landed it flush. So let's see if he changes up his footwork a little bit and tries to avoid further damage to the midsection moving forward. Nice defense there. Huge block. Beautiful jab. That one hurt. Felder's face would have to be classified as a mess. Cut on his cheek, and it's only getting worse. Oh, and he continues to effectively employ that jab. We told you he had one of the best in the game. He is putting it to good use tonight. Lee gets caught by the inside leg. Really threw a lot of power into that uppercut, but missed. One minute. Just missed with that right hand. That punch will work right through the door. Lee going for the body kick there, but he misses. No setup whatsoever there. Oh, power kick to the arms. Thirty seconds to go. These guys are swinging. Oh, he missed with that right hand. Just tagged him with the right hand there. Nice job to get the foot off the canvas and to the target quickly. Beautiful inside leg kick by Felder. Push kick there to the body. Oh, he has landed a high volume of strikes in this round and really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. The striking has been on point every step of the way. Careful to not gas out, but you gotta like the output here down the stretch. And there's a nice head kick that lands. And here's another head kick. And here's one more perfectly placed head kick. Some real clean striking on display in that round. Great counterfight. Ariane Celeste in the building.
tonight, but for me, it's been all about the cardio. I mean, look at these two guys, fresh as a daisy, barely sweating, and both bringing a lot of stamina into this round. So the work in the gym certainly paying dividends, whether it's training at altitude or three a days, whatever it is, you don't have to worry about the cardio of these two guys abandoning them on fight. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. Vision could become an issue, and that left eye starting to close. Really swung for the fences with that hook, but misses. Well, you didn't see a lot of the body work from him in the earlier rounds, but he's certainly getting after it here. Big shot to the body connects there. We'll see if he can follow it up. Oh, effective strike there by Felder. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Oh, slip that left hand well, Joe. Oh, nice head kick. Just misses with the straight left hand. Wow, strong roundhouse kick there. Not there. Oh, he tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Lou. Head kick. Really swung everything into that kick, but fell short. Head kick. Three minutes to go. Oh, he is starting to put a lot more pressure on his opponent here, Joe. A lot lighter on his feet these last couple rounds of this fight. Went for an elbow. Oh, a huge block there. Big head kick. Just reached the midway point of the fight. That bruise on his outer thigh is really getting nasty. And there he swung with a haymaker. Oh, roundhouse kick lands. All right, so another strike to the body there. And Joe, we've seen in the later stages of this fight, not only an uptick in the aggression, but also in the body work. Didn't see a lot of that from him in the earlier rounds. Switches southpaw. All right, so a nice straight punch there after he caught the leg. He decides to punch out as opposed to going for any takedown. Throwing that jab now again, the fighter evades. Oh, he got cracked with the jab there, Joe, and his head is firmly on the center line, the one place it really can't afford to be. He's showing some vulnerability here by leaning right into his opponent's range. Let's see if he can make some adjustments here. Well done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Nice knee to the body. Oh, he lands a massive kick here. Felder's head kick looked like that one was blocked. Kick lands for him there. One minute now to go in the third. Just out of range with the straight left hand. Five seconds remain in the round. Man, this dude is relentless. He just continues to pour it on. Really as aggressive as any striker on the roster. Got to be careful here, Joe, to not gas out. But you at least have to admire the approach. Very effective here in this round. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. Final seconds of round three. That's 
three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship round. All right, that's the end of the round, and this cut on the cheek, Joe, could be a factor moving forward. Certainly better to have the cut below the eye than above it, but the cut man's now got to get in there, shut that thing, and prevent it from being a major factor now moving forward. And here's another kick to the body. And here's one more perfectly placed kick to the body. Amazing highlights from that round. The OG Ariane Celeste in the building with us tonight. You ready to fight? Ready. Fourth round now, fight schedule for five five minute rounds. All right, both fighters up off the stools and ready to go here in this next round. Coming off a good round, a round in which both fighters had their moments. Good back and forth action. And this should be a great round here as we try to decide this thing. High kick. Well, the offense has been there. He is landing some good shots, but not really stringing them together and putting combinations on his opponent. He's got to mix up his strikes, change his tempo a little bit, and try to get his opponent out of there by landing more than just one strike at a time. Connects there with the punch. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Oh, right hand is there for him, Joe. Shows him the left and then follows it up with a right. Nice one-two punch there by Felder. Just missed with the straight left hand. Pretty nice leg kick there, Joe. Good work on the feet by Lee. He's looking to land the right just out of range. Look at that jab. Nice. He's got hand skills for days. Beautiful combination of punches to the head. And he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by Lee. Oh, beautiful kick to the body there. And he just left himself wide open for that strike. Very vulnerable by leaning in, keeping the guard high to allow for an opening down low. Just over three minutes to go. Straight right hand, no good. All right, less than three minutes to go here in round number four. Lands a nice straight, and there's that inside leg kick. He's got a beautiful leg kick. Looked like he might have landed there. Instead, a swing and a miss by Lee. Slips the punch. He caught the kick. All right, let's go of his leg now. That shot blocked by Lee. Look at that nasty jab. Felder's cut on his cheek at this point. I think you can classify it as disgusting. That thing will not stop bleeding. Doctor might come in here and stop this fight, Joe. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Big punch. Even when you block those, they'll still stun you. Oh, continues to land those jabs at will. Nice way to keep the opponent at distance. And he caught the kick. Constantly a moving target. Visibly limping here. High level MMA defense there, able to avoid the punch. Nice job by Lee. Jab. Just misses there with the left. Pretty strong leg kick there, Joe, by Lee. Oh, 
Under a minute to go in round four. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Joe, huge block there. The defense is holding up. Oh, oh beautiful left, left hand. hand for Felder. Straight right hand now, just misses. Kick to the body is there. Lee gets tagged by that straight punch. Nice land for the offense there. And there's the buzzer indicating the end of round four. Let's take a look at some of the action here. Here we see a perfectly timed kick connects flush. And here's another clean shot that lands. Here's a powerful head kick that lands. Incredible striking on display in that round. The original Ariane Celeste, good to have her in the building as usual. So here it is, folks, fifth and final round. Going to the leg kick now, and it's there. Nice job by Lee. Man, that was a perfect counterpunch. Oh, and there's a kick to the body, not having that one blocked by Lee. He got hit with the left hook. Both fighters throwing heat now. Just misses with the jab there. Felder gets tagged by that stiff jab. Defense not there for him thus far tonight. Nice punch by Lee. Man, that eye is so swollen now, Joe. You've got to wonder, he might be dealing with a fractured orbital. I'm not a doctor, but that looks pretty bad. Can we show you the total strikes? He blocks the punch. Well-placed kick there by the Irish Dragon, Paul Felt. Head off the center line, slips the punch. Felder gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. Oh, his leg is hurt here. You can see him limping a little bit, Joe. More than Well, the right hand has been there at times, not that time. Oh, and he ate a front kick. Just missed with that huge kick. Three minutes now to go to decide this one. Well, you got to start to change things up here defensively. Again, he gets clipped to the head, and again, he's vulnerable by leaning right into his opponent's wrist. So clock starting to become a factor here. A swing and a miss by Felder. The kick gets through. Oh, right punch followed by a left there by Lee. gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Beautiful straight punch there by Lee. Throwing it to the body there. Two minutes now to go in the fight. Beautifully placed in time knee there by Felt. Effective punch there by Lee. There you go. Look Sniff that one out as he blocks the kick. Oh, lands that punch. 
Just missed with the left there. Oh, big kick! Timely defense there, huge block for him. He landed a left hand there. Sweet axe kick. Well, one got through, that kick was blocked. Felder gets caught with that punch. Very nice leg kick for him there. Can't take too many of those. Oh, left hook to the head, it's blocked. Well, yet again, he goes back to the jab and he lands it. And defensively, this fighter is going to have to figure something out. He continues to lean into his opponent's striking range. He's going to have to stick and move and figure out a way to get his head off the center line. High kick. Nice body kick. Going to the side kick. 20 seconds to go in the fight. Nice kick to the midsection. Just a slip there. That's a really strong leg kick there by Lee. What a fight. All right, so this one will go to a decision. We should have a clear winner here, Joe, just due to the amount of significant strikes he landed. The stats really tell the story in this one, and you gotta think he is really happy with what he was able to accomplish in this matchup tonight. Round three. This is a very nice shot that gets through. Excellent kicking technique. Round four. Look at the torque in this kick. Absolutely perfect technique. Lands very cleanly. And here in the final round, look at this beautiful kicking technique on display. All right, the official decision is now in. Here is Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score the contest. 49-46. For the winner, by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon! Well, what else can you say about Bruce Lee after a performance like this one? Seemingly everyone on the roster wants to take their cracks against one of the founding fathers of mixed martial arts. And candidly, thus far, few men have succeeded. This just might have been Bruce Lee.